Hey everyone, how are you? Welcome to another question and answer session for MRCS exam. This is the physiology portion of the MRCS. So first of all, let's see the question. A 67 years old male is admitted to surgical unit with acute abdominal pain. He is found to have right-sided pneumonia. The nursing staff put him on to 15 liter of oxygen via non rebreathable mask. After 30 minutes, the patient is found more bad more event so it is agitated and by the nursing stuff an arterial blood gas analysis done and it reveals pa 7.15 partial pressure of carbon dioxide 10.2 which is very very high partial pressure of oxygen 8 which is slightly low though 15 liter of oxygen is given bicarbonate 32 base axis minus 5.2 what is the most likely cause of this patient deterioration now the options options are acute respiratory alkalosis secondary to hyperventilation over administration of oxygen in copd patient metabolic acidosis secondary to severe ventilatitis metabolic alkalosis secondary to hypokalemia acute respiratory acidosis secondary to pneumonia so we have to find out one of the option and it is one of the difficult questions so we have to approach very slowly and carefully so here you can see 67 years old male this point we have to note that it is a male patient and present with acute abdominal pain in case of any type of abdominal pain usually present with acidosis and also the right-sided pneumonia and pneumonia also they are uh, usually develop acidosis nursing system put 15 liter of oxygen that means the huge amount of the oxygen through the non rebreathable mask that means the most of the oxygen enters into the body but after 30 minutes patient so it is agitated what is the cause so let analysis this uh, abc finding first of all pa is 7.5 which is very very less and acidosis because normal range of pa is in our body blood it is 7.35 to 7.45 so 7.15 it is very very less from this equation then partial pressure of carbon dioxide it is 10.2 which is very high 10.2 which is very high partial pressure of oxygen it is 8 bicarbonate 30 and base axis minus 5.2 so why base axis minus 5.2 because the most of the oxygen it converts into the lactate into the peripheral blood and bicarbonate 32 that means base also increases so here we can see this patient has acute respiratory acidosis and because this patient suffering from the copd because it is a male patient so maybe the patient is a smoker with compensatory metabolic al metabolic alkalosis that means the elevated bicarbonate in the main clue of chronic nature of respiratory acidosis blood gas picture is typical in copd patient who has received mass oxygen so ex oxygen is not always helpful sometimes it may be life threatening so giving oxygen we should be more more careful especially in children so giving oxygen is not always good it may cause life threatening complication because we know that the excessive oxygen it uh, creates the reactive oxygen species and causes the tissue damage so this patient lose their hypoxic drive for respiration so in case of copd patient usually hypoxia driving the respiration that means the hypoxic condition uh, the central respiratory system it is uh, acts on the hypoxic drive it acts on the central receptor of the respiratory center but when we are giving mass mass oxygen this hypoxic condition is lost so the hypoxia is usually lost when we giving 15 liter of oxygen so in this condition the patient usually stop breathing or diminish the breathing or breathing power so in this condition carbon dioxide retention occur and more more carbon dioxide trapped in the body and therefore retain carbon dioxide and subsequently a hypoventilation hypoventilation it's leading to respiratory arrest arrest and if we cannot take immediate measure finally 
patient will die so if the bicarbonate was normal then the answer would be acute respiratory acidosis or secondary to pneumonia but the bicarbonate also increases to compensate the ph but the bicarbonate increases but this bicarbonate also fail to maintain the normal ph which is the 7.35 to 7.45 so our answer is the over administration of the oxygen in COPD patient in case it is in respiratory alkalosis in this condition respiratory alkalosis is not possible because their carbon dioxide is more and we know the carbon dioxide it is directly related to acidic condition and here we can see metabolic acidosis due to severe pancreatitis if metabolic acidosis develop in this condition bicarbonate condition uh, bicarbonate will be decreases but here the bicarbonate increases for this condition um, uh, just uh, always keep mind this equation which is the ph ph is proportionate to bicarbonate by partial pressure of carbon dioxide so in case of metabolic acidosis that means acid that means ph is decrease in this condition bicarbonate will be decreases but here we can see the bicarbonate more which is the 32 and normal range of bicarbonate is 24 to 28 so in this condition bicarbonate increases so uh, it is either metabolic alkalosis or compensated form of respiratory acidosis and the there you can see the uh, metabolic alkalosis is secondary to hypokalemia it is not possible uh, because we're giving more and more oxygen and there is the pneumonia also so in this condition respiratory changes will occur and it is acute respiratory acidosis secondary to pneumonia no pneumonia it is also not true because acute respiratory acidosis secondary to pneumonia uh, acute respiratory acidosis secondary to pneumonia acute uh, it occurs only when the pH is less changes. It is 7.15, but when one lung fully active and other lung mildly active, so in this condition pH is not reduced more more. That means 7.1, it is not possible. So in this condition, our final answer is the over administration of the oxygen in case of COPD patient. So I think it is uh, clear and also the normal ranges of the different uh, parameters we have to remember. So here we can see the pH, pH normally 7.35 to 7.45. Partial pressure of uh, bicarbonate, uh, partial pressure of carbon dioxide, it is usually 4.5 to 6.5 or uh, 4 to 6.5 uh, kilopascal. And partial pressure of oxygen, it is 10, 8, usually the normal range of partial pressure uh, of oxygen, it is 10 to 12 or 10 to 13. And base axis bicarbonate, bicarbonate normal range 24 to 28 millimole per liter. And base axis, it usually minus 2. So it is the normal range. So normal range also this parameter we have to remember carefully. Thank you.